Welcome to Decoding the Dress Code with De Bretz and our good friends at number one Savile Row, Eves and Hawks. Sometimes we're lucky enough to get an invitation to a party and that party has a dress code. Well, I'm here today with our good friends at Geeves and Hawks to help decode the dress code. The one dress code that we get asked about most at Debrett is the lounge suit. What exactly is a lounge suit? Well, the very short answer is a lounge suit is just a suit. And you might get that dress code for a cocktail party, a fairly formal business event. Either way, a smart business suit is exactly what you need. We have a beautiful example of such a suit here. Now, a lounge suit could be single or double-breasted, double it could be two or three-piece. Here we have a wonderful three-piece suit and you can see two buttons. People often ask about buttons and the importance of those. Broadly speaking, if you're tall and large, then a double-breasted suit with two buttons is perfect. Uh, if you're taller and slimmer, then maybe you can go for three buttons or if somewhere in the middle, how about two buttons? The general rule is that a suit is worn, stood up with the buttons done up, and then when you sit down, you undo the buttons. In terms of cloth and pattern, broadly speaking, the more elaborate the pattern of cloth, the less versatile it will be. So if you're gonna have one good suit, make it fairly uh, plain pattern or a fairly dark color, and that gives you much greater versatility when you come to match it with other things. The details of the suit, are important. Let's have a look at a few of those. All suits will have a double vent on the jacket at the back. You can think about the lapels too, whether they're notched or peaked, but actually that doesn't matter. It doesn't make a difference as to whether it's a lounge suit or not. That's the basic suit. Let's have a look at the accessories that would go with this. Well, we need to think about the shirt. And again here, if you've got a dark suit, you can have a fairly uh, plain coloured shirt and then you can brighten it up with accessories such as the tie or the pocket square. If you want a fairly uh, lively coloured shirt, then of course don't go for too lively coloured tie. There'll be too much going on. And never forget, your clothes should never have more to say than you do yourself. Shirts should be what we call a full collar and double cuffed. And of course, to add a splash of colour, the tie and the pocket square. Remember, the pocket square must never match the tie. They should complement each other, and of course as a shirt, and of course a suit, but they must never match. Finally, you need to match the suit with shoes. Best to have a dark pair of shoes. Typically people will wear black oxfords for a lounge suit, but we can talk about some other options. That's it, that's everything you need to know to get you started looking for a really good lounge suit. If you need any more information, have a look at our website, have a look in our books.